Okay, folks, firstly, thanks for volunteering to be a co-participant in this research. You'll find it really useful. It won't be that time consuming and you'll be doing a great service to your fellow students, both present and future. So let's have a little look at what this is going to involve for you. Okay. Well, firstly, you're going to be actively involved. It's real research. This isn't just some, let's get the students involved in something. You're going to work with the research team, me and my assistant, and some of the faculty, and we'll treat you really well. And essentially, what it's all about is helping your teachers become even better so that students have a better learning experience and it's actually more interesting. Now think about it, you're the student in the classroom, you have a full experience of what's going on, so your experience, your feelings, whether you feel interested, engaged and learning, as well as those experiences of your classmates, you can capture these for sure there. And what that means is that you're in a great position to provide some real insight into the experience of learning. What is it that your teachers do, or some of them, sometimes, that make your learning better, more interesting, more engaging? And equally, what are the things that don't help so much, that bore you? That's what we're trying to find out. So these are the specific things that you need to do. Obviously, you are, your first priority is to learn what's being taught. So don't worry about that. Just concentrate on the lesson and learn it the best you can. But is the big thing that you're going to do. Post the lesson sometime during that day, and this isn't going to take too long, but make relevant notes in the journal we provide for you on what you think was good teaching in that session by the lecturer. Was there something the lecturer did that, well, you thought, yeah, that really helped me to learn, or I felt good about that, or that was interesting. Just make a note of it. Equally, if there's something that you didn't like, you got confused about, or you felt it was boring, or it just had a negative effect for you, just make a note of that. So quite simply, just write those key things. You don't need to write lots of stuff, just those significant things that seem to impact your learning positively or otherwise. And finally, and try to do this the best you can. Again, I don't expect you to spend too much time on it, but as you chat to your classmates over coffee, just ask them about their experience of last week's lesson. Again, what do they find useful, interesting? See how it fits in with yours. It may be the same, it may be different, but make some key notes about their experiences. We don't need names, just what is useful, interesting, or not useful and interesting. And remember, you can talk to me at any time, so this is just a reminder of your key notes. So I'm really pleased that you're joining me.